So this is a Google Ads campaign. Uh, I want to run through a quick 14-day campaign. This is the 1st of um, May to the 14th of May 2024. And this is the dashboard. This is how uh, easy and um, easy to understand dashboard that Google give you. But before I talk about that, I want to give you the reasons and the logical why you should be running Google Ads or at least looking at it if you've got a budget. Okay. Um, well, simply fact, simply put, this is behind Google Keyword Planner now. And we talk about UK stats. So if you're in Ireland or any other part of the world, this is not this is not going to be applicable for you, but it's essentially the same. We could do the same across the world, um, you know, but we're looking at the UK at the moment. So England, um, Scotland, Northern Ireland and Wales. OK, and I've basically asked Google how many people are actually searching for, you know, what's my house worth, property evaluations, estate agent near me, um, you know, and that sort of thing. But as of May 2023 to April 2024, collectively, OK, the blue line here. So if I give you, it gives you a little pretty little graph. Um, as of May last year, so 2023, there was one one million two hundred and fifty seven thousand two hundred and eighty people did a Google search for for that type of need, i.e., you know, uh, looking at Google, basically doing a Google search for relevant terms related to you know their next property search basically which is what it's all about then it dipped to um in november 20 uh, sorry december 2023 it dipped uh, as of obviously every you know seasonality january got a massive bump 1.5 almost 1.6 million people uh, did a google search for you know um words and phrases into google returning to um you know all of the above, which is all about property. You know, they're looking for the next property. They're looking for a, a property valuation. They're looking for this. Now, I've got a list here. Um, obviously, what I've done, I've given Google a list of, of phrases and what we're looking at. Um, as a monthly breakdown, um, that will be collective, of course, and that will have all sorts of, you know, um, words around that. But you look at the words estate agents near me, got typed into Google 60,500 times. The term property evaluation got typed into Google 27,100 times every, you know, aggregated, because you can see there's a little map here as well that takes you through. So if May last year, there was 49,000. Then it went up to 60,000 in July. It dipped again for obviously, the, you know, and it's basically up in January to 90,000, uh, which is incredible. And now we're at 90,000 and hasn't really moved. Okay, so we're looking at Mar um, April's figures just at the end here. It hasn't changed. So these are historic uh, numbers, but it just goes to show, guys and girls, in 2024, these are numbers, but these are people. Okay, these are these are families that have did a Google search, that have gone to this little tool here and typed in blah, 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 estate agent near me next property four bedroom properties all the you know it's all about intent really so we're getting in front of people when they're most likely to be looking for your services so anyway i digress so this is that's this is the result of those people so in this particular postcode for this particular estate agent we um have already this month generated 19 valuation appointment opportunities these are 19 families that have gone through our process, which is they've hit a landing page, they've gone through the survey, they've gone through the quiz, and they've they've ended up with a um, with a conversation with a potential um, you know uh, family uh, or the agent has basically reached out to them to you know have the conversation. We're using ChatGPT and text message marketing on the back of this, so obviously we've got this speed to lead uh, issue that most of you probably are feeling. If you're running any kind of marketing, you've probably got a bank of leads that you've um, contacted but or, or sorry generated but not contacted yet because obviously we get busy and stuff like that so uh, we use chat gpt and text message marketing to basically reach out to everybody within the first five well between five and ten seconds depending on where obviously you know wi-fi and all that sort of jazz but that 19 lead okay 19 families came from 74 clicks so the 74 minus 19 the remaining balance will then start seeing us on remarketing on on, on other platforms, not just Google, but obviously social media and stuff like that. But each lead has cost £15. Now, we know that the average exchange value for this agent um, 
is around about three and a half to four thousand pounds. So we're more than happy in spending fifteen pounds to get that opportunity. Um, obviously, not everyone's going to come to market, so we do need this thing called lead nurture, lead follow up, so on and so forth. But you know. I'm hoping that by the end of the month that at least four, three of these have had an actual valuation and then the rest of them will build up this pipeline. We're building up this pipeline of, you know, basically securing tomorrow's business today at, um, you know, cheaper than what they would throw at leaflets and other types of marketing because we're simply running ads to people who have said to Google, yes, I am I'm hungry. I need a, I need a property. I need a stage and I need a valuation. I need some kind of idea of how much my house is worth and that sort of thing. And that's all we're doing is we're basically I'm making an offer to the right person at the right time um, when it's right for them. So, um, and we've only had 238 impressions. Now in Google, you don't pay for the impression. So that's very, very powerful. So um, yeah, if this is something you'd like to have a chat with us about, then we can you know drop me a message. Um, you know, that's, that's pretty much it really. I'm going to share with you uh, on the next video, some other results. And uh, but until then, I'll, uh, I'll keep you all guessing. And uh, if you've got any questions, uh, drop in below, and I'll look forward to seeing you very shortly. Take care now.